Hello, Rees. Come and sit down. Hello, Dr Range. Phew. Did you ride your bike here today, Riz? No. So why are you wearing your helmet? In case I fall down, Dr Range. Oh, have you fallen down recently, Riz? Yes, but I don't remember much. One minute I was standing up and the next minute I fell on the floor. Ugh. I'm sorry to hear that. Do you remember how you felt before you fell down? Hmm. I remember feeling a bit sick and dizzy, Dr Range, but that's all. Sounds like you may have fainted, Riz. I don't think I've painted anything, Dr Range. Fainted, not painted. What's that? Fainting is like your body suddenly going to sleep without telling you. Why did my body do that, Dr Range? You might have fainted for lots of different reasons, but it might be because of something that happened in your brain. What's my brain, Dr Range? Your brain is a very important part of your body. Inside, there. Inside my head? But Granny said my head's made of wood. It's not made of wood, Riz. She's joking. You've definitely got a brain inside there. What does it look like, Dr Range? It looks a bit like this. It's all wrinkly. It looks like a big nut. And that makes my body do everything. Everything you do and everything you think is controlled by your brain. It's a bit like your body's very own computer. It doesn't look like a computer, Dr Range. But your brain does work a bit like a computer. How? Oh! Your brain sends and receives millions of messages around your body all the time. Messages like, move your arm. Wow! My brain is really clever. But why did my brain tell me to faint and fall down, Dr Range? That's what we're going to try and find out today, Riz, by doing a special test. Oh, a test. Will I have to do a puzzle, Dr Range? It's not that kind of test, Riz. You won't have to do any puzzles. Oh, Granny does crossword puzzles all the time. She says they're good for her brain. What test do I have to do, Dr Range? The test we're going to do today is called an electroencephalogram. An electro what -a -gram? Electroencephalogram. It's a bit of a long word, so we call it EEG for short. An EEG looks at the electricity inside your brain. Electricity in my brain? That sounds dangerous. Don't worry, Riz. The electricity in your brain is a special type of electricity. 